Okay, so uh, Gavin Newsom, the current lieutenant governor, your pal of uh, California, former mayor of San Francisco, his his solution to the homeless problem was to give homeless people a free bus ticket out of town oh. to another state. You never saw South Park? That really happened. He 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 ended up getting sued over it, but that was his solution, and um, he's. He's going to be probably the next governor of California because, you know, he's the nephew of Nancy Pelosi. And, Pelosi, Dave. Uh, he, um, he's he got all the, you know, he's he's basically the George Bush version uh, of the Dem- in the Democratic Party. You know, he's been given everything his whole life. He was friends with the Gettys. Uh, who have basically funded his whole career, gave him money to start his businesses, funded his campaigns, and um, he went from uh, mayor of San Francisco to lieutenant governor. He was going to try to run for governor, but Jerry Brown ran for another term, and um, so he's he's in line. So just get ready for more mil- milk toast Democrats, because that's where you know. After he becomes governor of California for What's wrong with terms. the Democratic Party, Dave? Everything. Uh, I see you're wearing a green shirt, Dave. That would be correct, sir. Yep. I'm All not right. going to eat your food, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> Made with organically grown eggs, by the way. Sweet. Uh, so what's organic, your message right? for the populace, Dave? Time to... Uh, let's Let's... New York State implement uh, ranked choice voting, so we don't have this paradigm of oh we can't we can't vote for the green because you're gonna elect Trump. Forget it. We we have a system. You rank We've been ballot. going through this since 2000 with Nader Gore. That's Explain right. it, Dave. Instant runoff voting. IRV. Fairvote.org. You rank your ballot instead of having just one vote. You rank your ballot. First, second, third, fourth choice. And, for example, in 2000, when it was in Florida, you had Bush and Gore both at 48%, Nader at 3%, and Pat Buchanan at 1%. So if nobody has over 50% of the vote, the person with the least votes gets eliminated, and the second choice picks for that eliminate a candidate get redistributed to the remaining to the remaining candidates right so politically if the political uh you know ideologies you would assume that most of the pat buchanan votes would go towards george bush so it would be george bush 49 percent al gore 48 percent ralph nader three percent and then nader gets eliminated those 3%, most of those get redistributed to Al Gore, and Gore wins 51 to 49%. And um, that way people get to vote their conscience, they get to vote their ideals, their hopes and dreams by being allowed to vote for Nader. And instead of him getting 3% of the vote, maybe he would have got 10% of the vote. And instead of the Greens necessarily campaigning against the Democrats or vice versa, it's a, right. it's a love-in. And, like, had a Ralph Nader gotten more airplay, right, he probably would have got more people to come out and vote. And more second-choice votes would go to Al Gore, right? But the, but the And also, there's more of a dialogue, because we're stuck in this paradigm, like where Nancy Pelosi said... Pelosi, Dave. Where she said, it's we're capitalists, and that's just the way it is, right? So... Um, we're not allowed to have a, any kind of dialogue. It doesn't get in there. Look what they did to Bernie Sanders, right? The the mainstream media marginalized them. The establishment Democrats did everything they could to stifle him, to kick him out of the the uh, the nomination, which he which he probably would have had if it wasn't for all the rigging that they had done. So. That's what I got to say. Now, you made IRV happen in Berkeley? Made it happen, right. Uh, ranked choice voting in 
instant runoff voting, IRB, are basically the same thing. Uh, ranked choice voting covers more. Um, it, it will, ranked choice voting will also work for what they call proportional representation, which is where instead of having a single seat district, you have, say, a three or a five seat district, and um, and instead of having to get fifty percent plus one, you have to get say, uh, 33% plus one or 25% plus one, right? Or 20% plus one. And then, uh, you, you gain a seat. Um, and it sort of lowers the bar. It also, um, it, you know, it allows, say, f like, f for example, in San Francisco, uh, or the Bay area where just about every single, um, uh, U.S. representative is a Democrat, right? If they had, say, a four-seat four seat district there and you only had to get 25% of the vote to gain a seat, very likely that uh, a green, you'd, you'd get a green in Congress, right? Uh, because if people are allowed to, to, to vote in a system like that, then... Um, you know, in which a, of course Dave tried to be, and he ran as a green against Maxine Waters. No. Is that Barbara Lee? Excuse Barbara me. Barbara Lee, forgive me. Pardon me, Maxine, Maxine Waters down in L.A. Uh, and she's actually uh, a lot better than. Um, well, I mean, where are some places in the country that have IRV, instant runoff voting, ranked choice voting? Who has it, Dave? Okay, San Francisco, Berkeley, San Leandro, Oakland. Um, I think uh, didn't Maine just approve it by Maine, referendum? Right, the state of Maine, the whole state of Maine now has it. Uh, I think Minneapolis, St. Paul, St. Paul, they both have it. Portlandia, Portland, they have it. I not that I know of. They may not that uh, I'm aware of. It's it's been in the works up there. Um, and uh, let's see, Aspen had it for a while, but then the. The uh, politicians up there got for public servants, Dave. Yep, they they freaked out and they got it revoked. Wow. And same in Ann Arbor, Michigan. They had it for a while, and uh, the Democratic Party started dying. Yeah, I don't know. You know, it's it's sad when it gets. Oh, Burlington, they had it too. Burlington, Vermont, where Bernie is from, they had it, and same thing, like. So you're yes. working on this here in New York State? We will be working on it, Rachel. Yes, Dave. All right.